for five minutes remaining and part in mouth time for all three lead cars, let alone those that are lap a down. So the battle going on, the Aston and the Ferrari, they're oblivious to what's going on behind. Yeah, but what's actually happened right there, I'm sure Johnny Adam is professional enough to keep out the way. There's a slight loss of momentum out of Surtees by the McLaren in the lead in this race. Ollie Wilkinson still there. He had a tiny bit of respite, but look, they're side by side, and the race leader needs to get through. He's been compromised, nearly hits the tail of Giorgio Rose. Ferrari and Marcello is alongside, and Dries Van Tor's ready to pounce. He's gone past. No, he hasn't. No. <laughs> McLaren still just about hanging on. Breathe. And oh, those contacts no. at the McLaren is taken off, unfortunately, clashing into Dingle. Oh, that is disaster for Jota. And that means uh, probably a red flag, one would presume. And that means somehow Marcello stays on the track. And Dries Van Tor is now Full up into second. Full yellow in 20 seconds. Full course yellow in 20 seconds. Both three compromised uh, enormously down there. And uh, unjust returns Roy Wilkinson, who drove a supreme race under enormous pressure. He's out of the car, but there's lots of uh, damage to the barriers. Down and, and the car the of course has gone over the barriers yeah. into, the, into the effectively what is a, a cops around through so he's out to the back part of the circuit where oliver wilkinson has had that accident first three cars side by side the and rescue also, vehicles already in position yeah, moving yeah. to the I mean, scene I, I don't there is the scene of the incident do you look at the barriers i mean there is major major damage to the barrier alone and of course the car is further you can see the car in that cops so that was a, a massive i mean that's going to be considerable length of time for the circuit to be repaired. I don't know what damage has done to the McLaren. I suspect it's unlikely we'll see the car out for race two this afternoon. Much discussed, but let's take a look at the replay of the units. You've got Giorgio Rona just in front of the first three cars. The Mercedes is on the outside, the McLaren's on the inside, the Dries Van Tor in the Audi is gaining behind them. John, take it away. Well, we don't actually see what happened. That's, I mean, that's shocking to see a car hit a barrier and then deflect. Here we go. Now here, you can see it's this, the Ferrari had, they were squeezed on the left-hand side. McLaren defending, Mercedes trying to find a way through. Now on board with Rota, he's, he's got cars on the other side. There's the McLaren going around. Now he actually, we didn't see the car, the Ferrari. Look for the situation, he almost himself had his own major accident. Well, horrible to be turning around, but uh, now looking from behind, this is jinking around the outside of the Ferrari. Comes across the past the Ferrari, clips the McLaren. They were so close together, very little room to negotiate. Now the last of the shots, this is looking from Dries Van Tor's point of view. This might be the one that tells the story. Well, that was very difficult because both cars are involved, so one might say both cars were... The trouble was that...